but currently appearing on stage in Oklahoma. It is, of course, Josie Lawrence. And, oh, Hello. there's just so much I could talk to you about. Firstly, oh, mate. <laughs> and I know it seems like years ago, whose line is it anyway? It was just well, brilliant back it, then and still it is. It still is. It's weird, isn't it? I mean, we still we still do it. You know, we did it at the Royal Albert Hall uh, before Christmas and they've just done it in Edinburgh, but I, I couldn't do it because I was in Oklahoma. Um, but so it's still going. I, I think they called the Hoosers, the fans. The uh -huh. Hoosers, <laughs> which is great. Uh, and they still love it. And of course, it's still being shown in America. So I'm still great friends with like Greg Proops and oh. Colin Mockery and all that. It lot. was just so yeah. funny. Yeah. So funny. But, and but, would still stand now on television as good oh, as, as so. it ever I, did before. And also, there's a load of really good young improvisers now. I've got my own, my, um, an all-female uh, impro group and the girls in that are fantastic. So it would be nice to get a younger generation mm. in there. Yeah. But, you know. but you used to make it look so easy. I used to think, how do they do it? I, mean, I just, I loved watching you do it. Well, I, I'm back at the comedy store in two weeks' time, and I haven't done it for like three months because of doing this job. So I hope I'll be all right. You know what I mean? I hope I haven't got too rusty. <laughs> uh, that's the part-time job, is what you call that, isn't it? The best part-time job in the world. I bet it is. Yeah, because yeah. it's just getting together with friends again. Well, I it's guess. Paul Merton, Paul Merton, Andy yeah. Smart, Neil Malarkey, Lee Simpson, Richard Branch, and we've been doing it since 1985. Yeah, it's, it's just like time. going in and playing with my brothers. You yeah, know. yeah, no, I it feels it. good, doesn't it. it? But like we say, Oklahoma has been taking over your life for, for the past little while. It has. Um, what, have you enjoyed being on stage doing it? I mean, it's a big musical that lots of it. us are very familiar with. We all know the songs. Yeah. So you kind of feel like you're taking on a role that... Absolutely, you know, absolutely. We know it's it. My, it's my second Rogers and Haberstein, because years ago I did King and I. King and I, yeah. Because I think Lorraine dressed up as... As Mrs. Anna at one point. Oh, did she? Yeah, she did. She <laughs> borrowed Elaine, Elaine Page's dress. So they have to be young. It's got to be like the first time they kiss, the first time he kills someone. I mean, the scene where they kiss for the first time is just wonderful because Hughie and Amara are two beautiful creatures. They're all beautiful creatures. <laughs> uh, and when they kiss, it's just gorgeous. I have loved... Be I think this... I think... Sorry, I didn't mean to point. That's... I think it's totally fine. You can do what you want, Josie. I think this, I think this is one of my favourite jobs ever. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, I like the fact you described that you had cheese in your fridge that was older than yes. some of the cast members. I said so to Imogen, say... where were you born? And she went, 2000, Jose. <laughs> I thought, no. <laughs> No. no, don't exactly. I think these trousers are older, actually. <laughs> <come> to think <laughs> of it. <laughs> but as you say, it sort of it keeps you feeling that way, doesn't it? I mean, I we're love talking it. about turning sixty, and we're calling it sexy. Yeah, well, that like occurred. That, that occurred. Uh, we do these warm ups that they all the dance captain, and he said, just just try and keep up as best you can, Joe. So not try and keep up. <laughs> Phew. Uh, uh, and uh, they played that song. You know, I'm sick. Sexy and I know it, oh, and course. so I was singing. I'm sixty and I know it. <laughs> and they said, "Oh no, Josie, you're, you're, you're sexy." Of course, it, it was then put into a newspaper article, so it sounds like I meant it for serious, real. You know, <laughs> of course, it was just <laughs> it's just a joke. But they're lovely. I've I, they I'm either Mama Josie, and they come into my dressing room and say, "Will you help me with my audition?" Or this is happening. Or I'm Jose, you know, and uh, go off to Brighton Pride with the them. And all that. Exactly, it's, it's, it's all there. It's all there. Yeah. Um, what's it like being described as a cult figure? Um, off the back of Good Omens, of course. Ah, gosh. I mean, blink and you miss me in that. <laughs> he put in the script, I think, uh, that she looked not unlike the actress Josie Lawrence. So, and she said, "Let's hope that works." Of course, it did work. <laughs> But yes, loads of people write to me now saying, oh, you're Agnes Nutter. And, yeah, it's yeah. a big... It's She's a, a great part. Yeah, and a huge it's following a, of, the, of huge the entire following. show. Huge. But like we say, look, Oklahoma, it runs until September 7th. It runs so... until September 7th, and then after that, I'm back with my Comedy Store Players, because so that's comedystoreplayers.com. OK. Come and see us. Why, uh, why not? Oh, I'd love to. <laughs> you're all back together. I'd happily yeah. do it. Thank you so much, Josie.